Bears wanted it again. Bolden. Nice look from Olenek. And Bolden buries the three. And Bolden, for the third time, hits the three out of a timeout. It's a nine-point game. It's, Gonzaga has always done that, haven't they? They've always come out of a timeout. Even though it was Washington State's timeout, they drew up the play and scored on it. Thompson. Great defense there. Bolden with the rebound. With 19 points. Olenek will shoot free throws. Now Gonzaga pushing the tempo. Stopping the ball, getting one shot uh, for Washington State, getting the ball down the floor. Kind of the recipe that got Washington State their lead in the first half. Exactly, and it's just uh, changed uh, shoes on the other foot. Olini, the son of a coach. He's very instinctual for a body that big. He's going to be a great player at Gonzaga. And Matt Bolden now with 19 points and a big three. And it's a seven point game. It's been quite a while since Gonzaga's been this close. And now the fans are in there. 6,000 people on their feet at the McCarthy Athletic Center. This is Capers. Grant Gibbs guarding Moore. Now the switch. Topra Vitsa was open for three in the corner. He couldn't get him the ball. And now Capers drives on Bolden to the middle. Skip pass, Copra beats open, three no good. Rock with the rebound, but a foul is called on number 10, Grant Gibbs. This will be his second. And six on Gonzaga. So Copra Vitsa will be inbounding for the Cougars. And Xavier Thames will be checking in for Washington State. You know, he had a big first half of Xavier Thames. He had some shots for the Cougs and kind of disappeared. He replaces Marcus Capers, Charlie Enquist, number 40 into the game with four personal fouls for Washington State. Gonzaga wanting it over and back there. Thompson drives the middle, throws up the shot foul called on Matt Bolden. This will be his third. I had a good look at that over and back. I, I don't think his feet came down on the line. Yeah, you have the to, ball, his feet came down on the line. Okay, you have to establish yourself in one point, and so if his feet came down at the same time behind the line, then he's okay. Right. I hate that pass, though, from the baseline all the way to yeah. the backcourt. That should be backcourt no matter what. Here, here's another look at it. See, that should be backcourt. See, his, yeah, he caught the ball kind of simultaneously. With, so, now, once you get it in the front court, you should be able to make keep him stay there. in there. Yeah, keep it there. Don't let him throw it down there. Two big free throws by Thompson. Yeah, who's shooting just four of 15 tonight. Came in shooting 62% from the field the last four games. Well, credit that to Gonzaga's defense. Bolden. Three ball! He's got 22. Really nice read by Matt Bolden. Defense goes behind the screen out at the top. He stops behind the screen and lets it go. And just nailed the three-pointer. Baseline drive. Harris with the rebound. Gonzaga with numbers. Rock. Harris. There was a whistle. I hope there was. Harris will shoot free throws. I say I hope because he was manhandled in there. He had the momentum. I tell you what, Harris has put these zags on his back this, this half, hasn't he? Got a double-double, 16 points, 10 rebounds. He's 4 of 5 from the line, 6 of 7 from the floor for the game. Great stats, but I think the intangible is, is the look on his face. He's he totally told these Bulldogs, the rest of them, let's get mean. Got him angry. Let's go. Get it on. Cowboy up. And D'Angelo Casto checks back in along with Clay Thompson. As Moore and Enquist check out for Washington State. So Ken Bone bringing all the firepower back into the game quickly. He's sensing the change in momentum. Gonzaga trailing by four. They haven't been this close since early in the first half. Well, it's been on a defensive end. They've really shored up what their problems were. And a foul here on Mangisto Rock. State will be shooting free throws, at least one. 
And Clay Thompson, an 81% shooter, is there. Yeah, not shooting it well tonight. Just two of four and four of 15 from the floor. Well, again, he's had a lot of pressure on him. And missed another. Harris with the rebound. Washington State claiming that Harris was in the cylinder on that rebound. Four point game. This is Rock. Trying to get to the middle. Now Bolden. Three ball short. Koprovica with the rebound. Bolden has hit six threes in this game. He's the only one to make one. Six of 11. Clay Thompson. Oh, big shot by the sophomore. Back to six. You know, very patient move. Caught the ball on the wing. And Harris went for the jam. Castillo with the block. And Washington State with the basketball. Xavier Thames on Bolden. It won't go. Gibbs had the rebound. And he does. And now he's got pressure. Now he dribbles out. Bolden far side. This is quite a ball game in Spokane. It's a prize fight. Turnover. <laughs> Both teams slugging right now. They're slugging wildly. This is like Ali Frazier. The Both are up jungle. on the ropes. Yeah. And everyone's still on their feet. At least the lower bowl here at McCarthy. Thompson three ball rattled out. Bolden with the rebound. And now Gonzaga slows it down a bit. And we've got a timeout. Timeout both on. Six point game in Spokane, 7.02 to play. Not sure I'd want to be anywhere else in the world right now. No, this is exactly what you want to see. You want to see a six point ball game. You want to see Gonzaga fight back like they fought back so far to get into this ball game. Remember, there was big leads by Washington State, so. I believe uh, the Cougars' largest lead was 15 as we take a look at the Associated Press poll, Kansas. At the very top, there's Gonzaga down at number 17. Yeah, Michigan State lost uh, twice, actually. They lost to North Carolina last night, too, so they drop, uh, they'll drop. they drop out of the top 10. Texas moves up. Now, remember, Gonzaga scrimmages Texas every year in Denver. It's a close scrimmage. And, uh, I just don't think we should have polls until January 1. Oh, you're, Get right. them in the league. <laughs> I mean, what do we know? I mean, what do we know? Nothing. Not a, not a darn thing. I mean, I don't think people thought either Gonzaga or Washington State would, would be as good as they're playing. No, uh, who would expect it? I mean, both teams were young, were young, inexperienced. They got one senior on each. Uh, Nicola is a, a senior, and Matt that plays significant minutes for their teams, and the rest of the guys are all inexperienced. So you would never have thought Gonzaga would be five and one and bring home the Maui Trophy from a tournament such as prestigious as that one. Basketball to play. They've only lost three games in the history of this building. Santa Clara, Washington State, and a Portland State coach by Ken Bone a year ago. It is loud. Well, this is the first time I've seen where our advantage of setting here. I've seen the other side stand up like the students. They're on their feet on a six point. They want Gonzaga to score here. This place might erupt. I tell you, this is the biggest game of the year in the Inland Northwest. Goodson playing with his four personal fouls. Matt Bolden. Seven on the shot clock. Here's Stephen Gray. They'll shoot it from 15. Short. Harris with the rebound. Got it to Bolden. New clock. Harris doing everything right now. He really is. Playing defense, deflecting balls on the defense, giving Washington State one shot, grabbing the rebounds. Got 18 points and 11 rebounds. Harris spins, lost the handle, got it back. Stephen Gray. Olenek fakes the three and drives on Koprovica. Blocked by Castle, but a foul is called. And the freshman from Canada will shoot free throws. 
and Kelly Olenek has all six bench points for Gonzaga. Yeah, I mean, if there's a question mark, it's going to be Gonzaga's bench, right? They don't have anyone to really go in. But Clay Thompson, he's the go-to guy for the Cougars this year. Not afraid to shoot the basketball. And Harris at the other end will shoot free throws. Actually, Olenek will when we come back. Or just text Zags to 27297. That's 27297 or Arby's. Or fill out an entry form at a participating Arby's restaurant today. I'm thinking.